I was reading an excellent blog by Neil Patel on SEO, and um, and then I noticed that the um, the website, the HTTPS website, um, contained mixed content and was insecure. Um, so I thought we'll make a quick video to explain how to get the website secure. Your HTTPS website um, needs to have this green padlock activated so that users know that they've got a secure encrypted connection and so if they ever use the contact form um, to reach out and I encourage you to reach out to Craig uh, here at Design Kink uh, if you want to chat more about um, web design and things like that but I'm just going to quickly show you how we can get that secure uh, padlock up there very very quickly okay so in WordPress that is now I know Neil's using WordPress and I'll show you why in a moment but in his settings in WordPress um, he'd have his uh, URL set to HTTPS which is correct but you need to make sure that all the code and everything is uh, also HTTPS to make sure that you get that secure padlock on there of course you've got to have your SSL certificate in place now the quickest way to do that is by adding a plugin that will resolve all the URLs to the correct one. And I'm going to show you the one that I like using, but there's more than one around. Just type in HTTPS and you can see them. And if you're familiar with WordPress, you'll know that um, it's based on the ranking systems of users, and uh, you can see how many active installs and uh, how many star reviews and how many people reviewed to get that star review and um, I'm using this one it's had less reviews than some of the others but they've all been five stars I found it an excellent excellent website to use uh, plug in to use I've um, I must have something else installed at the moment that's doing what I want to do on this website but I'm just going to run through what what you would do to get that green padlock I'll, I'm pretty sure um, pretty sure I fixed mine up manually and I might go through that next just quickly but if you want to do it really quickly activate a plugin like this and this one's great with this everyone has their own way of um, getting into the settings sometimes they put the settings in the dashboard here this particular one uh, puts it in the actual plugins menu and um, you'll find that this one does just about everything to capture and they, as they say it's sometimes necessary to go nuclear um, but uh, hopefully we won't be seeing that in uh, non metaphorically anyway uh, capture save changes and that will do it that'll do it and that will fix up Neil's site I know Neil's site of course is um, WordPress, we can see the login there for it, the WordPress login. Um, but anyway, um, so if he just put that plug in and activated like that, 99% of the time that would fix that problem and you'd get a better SEO ranking. Um, if you couldn't fix it up that way, then you, again, you might have to problem solve even more and in that scenario I'd recommend something something like this so uh, a, a piece of uh, kit um, called HTTPS checker and that would run through and find um, find the problems for you um, we'll just run that You can get these HTTPS checkers online, and while that's running through, you can learn more information or learn more that way. And you'll see these um, on Firefox, um, it gives you a bit more information about what mixed content is, why it's a risk. Um, and how to tell if you've got it or not and how to fix it alright 
So you could go through it that way and fix it up manually by using a tool to check where the issues are and what they are. But as I've mentioned already, you can probably get around the need for that sort of uh, hassle by just using a plugin such as this one, the um, SSL Insecure Content Fixer, and having that set on that. And that's pretty much going to guarantee, <clears throat> not guarantee, 90, 99%. It depends on the theme you're running and the plugins and that. But um, it pretty much helps resolve every single link to the HTTPS. Okay, hopefully that was useful and helpful. And um, yeah, feel free to leave a comment and subscribe. Hope you're well. Bye.